Welcome to the support video for workload automation video series. This video will show you how to refer Control M Server New Day procedure. Control M Server run the New Day procedure at the same time every day. This procedure includes scheduling the day's automatic job and running the maintenance and cleanup utility, such as deleting the old job from the previous day. Due to the system or application maintenance, user may want to defer or delay the time of new day procedure to start. The new day time can be set to earlier or later time. In this demonstration, we will show you how to defer the new day procedure time to a data time through a CTMC utility. If the delay is more than a day, Control M server should be shut down until it is ready to schedule the application job. For this instance, new day procedure will immediately executed when the Control M server is brought up, which has passed its new day procedure time. This is a demonstration to change the new day time forward or later time using the CTMC utility. First, we need to run the CTMC utility from the Control M server command line. Select option 2 for the system parameters. Select option 1 for daytime. This parameter is the start of daytime that the control M use. This time is when the control M date or OO date changes and the new daytime procedure runs. The default value is set to 7 o'clock. At the prompt, enter the value of the new daytime visitors write a plus sign. In this example, we set to 8 o'clock in the morning and enter. So enter plus sign 0 at 0, 0. Press enter and enter S to save and return to the main menu. Next, enter the queue to click from the CTMC menu. By now, new day time value should be saved and loaded automatically. Thank you and that concludes this Control M solution video. Please see our knowledge base and the YouTube channel for more video like this.